Because it's Kyle. I'm Denzel. OD Denzel. I'm sorry. And uh, today we have, upon the request of Super Cheesy, uh, our little buddy with, with our theme requests, uh, he's gonna he's asking us how we get uh, a custom background. And so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna take our little mission start theme uh, and uh, funny pictures, which are basically icons which are made up of um, our subscribers, our subscribers icon. icons. And if you want to know how to do that, uh, there's another video. Uh, go check out our channel. And uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to show you how to get a nice background in the back and format it correctly and whatnot. And so what you're going to need is, first of all, we need to go to uh, private var stash and navigate to the correct you directory. Are, you might want to let them know that you are SSHing here. Oh yeah, we are SSHing into our iPod using Cyberduck, and if you're on Windows, you'll be using WinSCP. And you first need to download OpenSSH in your iPod before it'll work. And then once you do all that and you navigate to private bar stash themes, and it's going to have some crazy amount, don't worry about what that it matches ours. You're going to go to a theme, and ours is called Test Drive right now, which we're going to change because now it's becoming the official mission start theme. So we're going we to do go not have an official mission start theme. Do not believe the words that he says. <laughs> For all intents and purposes. All right, mission start. And... What you're going to do is you're going to name a folder, and this is all in the first video. Where we did basically name a folder, and then in that folder we have icons, and then we named all the things. This is, I, I did it with Automator on, on a Mac, and it took very little time, but basically. And then what we're going to do is we're going to have a wallpaper PNG, and what we're going to do, I'm just going to drag this to the desktop real quick so you guys can see what we're going to be looking for. And um, as it downloads from uh, uh, Cyberduck, basically what you need to do is you need to, on a Mac, go in and take a snapshot or a screenshot. So basically, you're going to need to do this. You're going to need to hold shift, command, and the four button, I believe. And then see how that cursor changes into a thing? And we'll show you how that works in a minute. Let's right click to get out of that. But first, as you can see, we'll click command I on this. Uh, we're going to need to find a picture that is 320 by 480. And when you take a screenshot on a Mac, it automatically formats as PNG. So we're fine on that. So I just have gone ahead and it Googled HD wallpapers. And Denzel, which one do you think looks good? That was my guitar. Aww. My $300 guitar. <laughs> which one do you think is good? Um, that one. All right. Xbox Live HD wallpaper. And so what we're going to do is we're just going to go see full size image. And this can be used with any picture or even your background if you want. And um, Denzel, what have you gotten me into here? Uh, let's see that one. His guitar is okay. You wanted to know. Oh, God. I think you've taken me down a dark road, Denzel. So. Okay. What's wrong? So now what we're going to do is, is we're going to take, and now it's beautiful, and we're going to go ahead and do that thing. Again, Shift, Command, 4. And um, on this, it's going to be a little hard to see, but you can see my cursor has adjusted to the background. And what we're going to do is we're going to try to get that Xbox Live in there. So we're going to click on the corner, and we're going to drag. And so at the bottom of my cursor is it's going to count the pixels. And so we're trying to do 320 by 480, right, Denzel? Yes, sir. Okay. So 320 by 480. <laughs> and as you can see down by my cursor right here, it's 320 by 480. And although the Xbox Live is not perfectly centered for the sake of this video, we're just going to go ahead and click. And uh, what's this going to do? You're going to hear that little picture sound. And on our desktop now, we have a 320 by 480 picture. And we'll just call this wallpaper.png. And this is not just for me and vanity. This is actually what you need to call it. So we're going to send this one to trash so there's not two things. And you need to call it wallpaper.png. And there it goes. Now you have a nice PNG wallpaper. And then what we're going to do is we're going to overwrite this one. So you're going to drag it into your theme name. So we're going to go under our mission start theme right there. And then we're going to drag it in. So take this drag it right in there. And it's going to replace the old wallpaper. It's going to ask if you want to overwrite it, but that's because we have an older one, and it's going to replace. And so now what we're going to do is after a quick respring, you'll find that with our Mission Start app, we'll have a different back background. So we're going to respring, and we'll meet you right back. All right, and we're back. And as you can see, we have that weird, giant, bulbous Xbox Live thing. 
And um, yeah, so if you have any questions, um, I know this would be a bit hard to execute on Windows, so if you want me to do that, request it, then I can sort of finagle some way to do that. Is there, do you know any way to screen capture on? Uh, I'm pretty sure there's print screen on, on Windows and okay. stuff, so I, I don't know. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or PM me, preferably PM, so we know we got it. But um, I think that's all. Yeah. Uh, so this has been Kyle and Denzel from Mission Start. And I bid you a good day. Oh, God. Good day. Oh, all right. We're going to. Thanks for watching.